In this video, I'm going to be showing you the best clipping software for the lowest delay and best performance. This software is free and super easy to set up, so stay tuned. If this video helped you at all, I highly recommend you check out risentweaks.com. They have the best tweaking panels which are built to unlock your PC's full potential, delivering smoother performance and lower latency through advanced system optimizations. I got my PC tweaked by them and the performance increase was actually insane. I will make sure to leave a discount code in the description below. The first thing you guys want to do is join the Discord server in the link in the description below. Now you guys want to find yourself to the free tweaks channel and then scroll up until you see the obsproject.com slash download. You're going to want to go down then download the installer right here. I already have it downloaded, so I'm not going to do that. All right, guys. Now, once you have OBS open, you want to go down into your sources, hit the plus right here, and make sure you go to game capture. And make sure it's not display capture because that will give so much more input delay. Just hit game capture. You can name it whatever you want. Hit OK. Capture mode. Just leave it on default. And you want to scroll down here, and you want to make sure limit capture frame rate is checked. Hit OK. Now we're going to go to the settings. You want to go to the video right here. You want to make sure your base and output are both in the same resolution. And you also want to be on 60 FPS. So that once all of these are correct, you want to hit OK. Now you guys want to go up here in this blank box. You want to right click, check the enable preview. This gets rid of a lot of input delay. Then you want to go back into your settings and then go all the way to the advanced tab at the bottom. Scroll all the way down. And then uncheck this source, enable browser source hardware acceleration, check it, hit apply. Now we're going to go to output and then go to recording. You want to make sure you're on the advanced right here. And then for your recording format, you want to change this to MPEG-4. Now for your video encoder, you want to click on this. And if you're on an NVIDIA GPU, you want to use the NVIDIA H.264. And if you're on AMG, you want to use the AV1. So I'm on NVIDIA, so I'm going to hit the H.264. Now you want to scroll down. You want to change your bitrate. rate. You want to change this to 25,000. Now you want to hit apply. Now we're going to go into our hotkeys. So then we're going to scroll down until we see the record replay buffer. And then you want to set this to whatever you're going to use to clip. I personally use F1 and that's what I like. So then once you set it, you want to hit apply then hit OK. Now if you guys want to have OBS startup every time you open up your PC, you guys want to go into your task manager. So you're going to right click at the bottom, go to task manager. Then you want to find your OBS. So right here, you want to right click on it. Open the file location, go to obs64.exe, right click on it, and then hit create shortcut. Then you want to find your shortcut, right click on it, show more options, and hit cut. Now you want to go into the search bar at the top, type in shell, colon, startup, enter. Now we're going to go to the discord, copy and paste this line of text. Now we're going to right click on the shortcut, hit properties, and go to the target. Click inside of it and go all the way to the right, do a space, and then command V and paste the line of text. And you want to hit apply and hit OK. This forces OBS to start up every time you start your PC. Thank you guys for watching, and if this video helped you at all, I highly recommend you go to risentweaks.com and check out their tweaking panels. With over 4,000 reviews and an impressive 4.8 star rating on Trustpilot, you know you're getting top tier quality. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more content.